Uh, hello there and uh, welcome back to my new video. So in this video I want to show you how you can share the data between your application and uh, other different applications from your device. So uh, first we want to create a menu resource uh, file. Okay. So uh, our file should be named uh, menu, uh, main menu and click OK. So we are going to have just one menu item and uh, that item will be named share. Okay, so let's add this menu item. And let's change the title to uh, share. Uh, next, we're going to add the ID for our uh, menu item. Okay, share menu and okay. And now we're going to add the show as action attribute and uh, we're going to set that to always. So that means that our item will be shown on uh, action bar always. Okay, so uh, next we want to add the one icon, one vector asset. So let's choose this uh, share icon. Okay, and click next and finish. So we're going to specify this uh, icon inside our menu item here. Okay, and now instead of the text, we're going to see this icon. And we can also specify the color of our icon with the uh, icon tint uh, attribute. So let's uh, set the color to white. Okay, and uh, that's fine. So we, ha we have designed our menu. So we can run the application in the background. Okay, and now let's uh, close that. And let's uh, head over to our main activity. Okay, so we're going to override uh, two methods and the first one, uh, okay, sorry, uh, we get an error. Uh, okay, I think I know why. So uh, we forgot to add, uh, to properly format our ID. So we need to add the add sign ID plus. So let's uh, add that. Okay, so now everything should work fine. Okay, and as you can see, our application is uh, running smoothly. So uh, next thing, uh, we want to delete this line of code and instead we want to inflate our menu file. So the first uh, parameter should be our uh, resource menu file and the second one, a menu object. And we can just uh, return here a true. And the next method we want to override is uh, called uh, on uh, item, on options item uh, selected. So here uh, we're going to add else, uh, if and uh, else block. So in the first if block we're going to say if item uh, item ID is equal to our share menu. So basically we're going to head a click listener uh, on our menu items here. Okay. So uh, let's run our application uh, first. And as you can see, we can see this icon, but uh, our icon is not colored in white. And I think I know why uh, icon tint uh, attribute is working, but our API level is uh, not uh, high enough so we're going to remove this uh, attribute and instead I'm going to just change the color uh, of this um, vector inside our XML file so now it should be white colored okay so now uh, you, we can see that uh, it's working fine and uh, here inside this if block uh, we're going to basically write uh, the code uh, where we're going to share our uh, application data with other applications so we're going to do that by uh, using intent so first we need to specify an action. So we need to set uh, action to uh, intent action send. Uh, next uh, we need to put some data. So uh, we're going to uh, say intent uh, extra text. So we want to pass the text and the value of that text. So we're going to pass something like we are sharing data between two apps. Yay. Okay. And uh, next we want to specify a type text plane. And uh, we want to start the activity and just pass this uh, share intent. Okay, and now uh, depending on what application, uh, what applications your uh, device has, it will uh, open up and prompt you with those applications. So when we click this share button, it will prompt you that uh, window. And because uh, this emulator does not have a WhatsApp, Facebook uh, and so on, we cannot use those applications. But when I uh, try to share the data with the drive, it will just copy that data to clipboard so we can see and check uh, whether uh, it's the correct data. So let's paste, uh, paste that data. And as you can see, it is the same exact data. So for example, if you had a WhatsApp, you could share uh, that with your uh, contacts and uh, with your friends. I hope you enjoyed. Please uh, like this video if you find it helpful, of course, and uh, see you in the next one.